Saludos desde la República Dominicana. Greetings from Punta Cana, Dominican Republic. And I'm here at the TRS Turquesa Hotel, an adults-only, all-inclusive beachfront hotel. Um, it just recently reopened following several months of closure during the pandemic. And so I'm very excited and very happy to be the first travel writer, the first journalist to officially visit this property since it opened just a few days ago in November 2020. So I want to show you some of the beautiful facilities and amenities that, that they have here, as well as highlight some of the hygiene protocols that the hotel is following in order to keep travelers and staff safe. So first let's start out at one of the main pool areas, which you can see here is quite lovely. You get to see some of the hotel architecture as well. We've got a lovely little bridge there. And this is a little island right here where they actually can stage romantic dinners. I've heard. I haven't done it myself because I'm here alone. But anyway, that would be a very lovely place to sit um, after dark and have a candlelight dinner for two. So the pool area, this, this is one of multiple pool areas here. And as you can see, there's not many people. Uh, the hotel just reopened a few days ago. It's limited capacity right now, so it's very easy to social distance. Um, the service is uh, excellent, even when the hotel is completely full. Uh, but this is a very well-designed hotel with lovely landscaping, a lot of lush green plants everywhere, um, and a lot of activities to do. So we'll take a walk around here to show you some of what, what's uh, on offer. Um, one of the advantages of staying at this particular hotel is that TRS Turquesa is part of a large complex, uh, the Grand Palladium complex, which includes four different hotels. Um, but if you stay at the TRS, you actually get um, access to the facilities at all four hotels. If you stay at the other hotels, you don't. So this is really the top of the line offer um, in terms of uh, the all-inclusive product here at the Grand Palladium complex in Punta Cana. So that's a big selling point. It's adults only, so again, this is good if you uh, don't have the kids traveling with you or you don't want to be around other people's kids, this is a great option. Yet you can still enjoy the cuisine and the activities at the other properties as well. There's multiple restaurants, all different kinds of food. Um, I've had Peruvian, Japanese, delicious Dominican food, which I love. Um, so there's there's hamburgers there's a little bit of everything um and just a la carte menus so this isn't the the uh buffet experience that you may think traditionally is being all inclusive things have gotten more elegant in recent years and then also during the pandemic they've gotten more um health conscious and so there's there's not as many places where you're going to have to be touching high touch utensils so it's a very safe atmosphere i wanted to show you this fountain here behind me if i can get it in the shot um, I really like, I really appreciate the attention to detail that they have here. So really nice landscaping that's very well maintained, beautiful architecture. And I'm going to show you my swim up suite too, which is absolutely uh, gorgeous. And so that's just across the way here on the other side of the lobby. So these are the main grounds, but again, there's multiple pools, a lot of things to do, activities that range from um, water aerobics to dance lessons, to uh, cocktail making classes, which I think I'm gonna do later. And also, of course, there's a large fitness center, uh, currently reservation only, and that's a pandemic uh, protocol um, thing so that it does not get too crowded. There's a giant spa, which I'm also gonna sample later. So, and mul multiple restaurants. And this whole complex is very walkable. So you'll see that as, as we tour. swim-up suite at the TRS Turquesa Hotel in Punta Cana. So we're starting at the most beautiful spot here. I have my own two little lounge chairs here right on, right off of my balcony or, or terrace, whatever you'd like to call it. At any rate, I even like how they have touches like this. This is a very elegant kind of curtains here. So if you want more privacy, since there are other uh, suites that open up into this pool area, but lovely, very lovely space to, to relax. I can't wait to do so. Once we go inside, you'll see why this is a very wonderful place to stay. This is an adults only property again. So you have a very elegant kind of classic luxury feel. I love the four poster bed is beautiful. 
and lots of pillows, which I also like. I sleep with a lot of pillows. I'm one of those people. Um, so we have the, the spacious suite here. Again, this is the swim up suite category uh, that opens right out onto the water here. And then um, this is the seating area. So there's a nice, comfortable living area. Uh, a lot of space to spread out here and um, a large screen TV wall mounted, a lot of mirrors so you can see how beautiful you are. I can't wait to get a good night's sleep on this bed because I have a feeling I'm going to sleep super well here tonight. And uh, then to make it extra, extra romantic in case you're traveling some, with someone, unfortunately I'm not right now. There's a pool, not a pool, this is a tub. There's a tub right next to the four poster bed. So you can see the setup here is really created for romance. So this is a great place for couples, um, but it's great for, for singles and for, um, for friends and for adult families even really, because there's a lot to do on the property. This has a semi-open concept because it, you'll see the wall doesn't go up completely here. So you also have access to the easy access between the, the, uh, the tub and the dual sinks. And then for extra privacy, of course, there is the private area in the bathroom. You have the, uh, the shower stall and the water closet there with the toilet. So that is the room here, my suite here at the TRS Turquesa. I'm loving it so far. I love the spaciousness and the classic luxurious style. I had a really good lunch already um, as soon as I got here and I'm looking forward to exploring more of the um, on-site offerings, a lot of activities to do and I'm so glad to see this property is reopened and also practicing some really great protocols and the service has been so good. I'll tell you more about that. Here's an exterior view of the Swim Up Suites in TRS. Um, this isn't my, my actual suite, but just to give you an idea of what, there's, what the setup is like from the outside. So you have um, these curtains, which can provide you with added privacy, which I think is a great idea. So if you want to relax on your terrace, uh, you have all the privacy in the world. Then you, each, each of the suites gets their own uh, couple of lounge chairs there, and you can just step right into the, to the pool, which is shared, but it's just a small pool, just shared with a very few number of rooms. So you're never gonna be around too many people. I really love this because especially right now when people are trying to avoid being around too many other people, this way you're not at the, even at any main pool, although there's not many people at the main pool either. But regardless of the time of year or whether or not there's a pandemic, it's nice to have your own private space. And with this, what could be easier than just stepping out of your own room, stepping down into that beautiful water and relaxing for a while. So I really like that. It's peaceful and it's it, it has a greater sense of privacy so there's a lot to love about having a swim up suite i've only had one a couple times in my life and i think i might get used to that I'll tell you a little bit more about the hygiene protocols that are taking place at the TRS Turquesa during the pandemic to keep everybody safe. So right here at the entrance to the lobby, this is a good sign of what they're, of what they're doing. Uh, su salud nos importa, your health matters to us. So you'll see as you enter, when you first arrive, you're gonna be offered hand sanitizer. There's a dispenser right here. And, um, and also when you arrive with your luggage, they'll actually spray your, your check luggage with sanitizer as well to clean that off. And there's a sanitizing doormat. Let's see if I can get that there. So you step on that as well. And when you first arrive, they take your temperature. So they are very into making sure that everybody stays healthy and, and they enforce social distancing. You know, they, they, make the, they make it easier for people to do that by having things, the furnishings are spaced out. The restaurants are at limited capacity. So it's very well organized, very well planned. They also take your temperature when you um, arrive at the restaurants and I believe at the, possibly at the spa and the, um, and the fitness center too. The fitness center is, has limited capacity. So for now you need to make reservations um, to make sure that there are not too many people when you're there, which is a good thing. Even when there's not a pandemic, it's great to be in a, in a gym or a fitness center that's not too crowded. So that's a good thing too. Um, in terms of the room, which you'll see, um, they have a seal that they put on the door for every, every uh, hotel room. After one guest leaves, they do a thorough disinfecting, a thorough, thorough sanitizing, and then uh, they will um, put that seal on it so that nobody else goes in until the next guest arrives. Another thing you can do, which I always do nowadays, is I request that nobody come into my guest room to, uh, to clean the room 
unless I request it. So that way you don't have people coming in and out every single day. Although you can if you want, but um, I like to keep as few people as possible. And um, so it's good that they have the option that you can get the room service or the, the room cleaning or not. Now, I also wanted to show you that this is an example of how this is really, this complex is really like a resort village. It's very walkable. And this is, this is the part of the complex where I'm staying where the swim up suites are, which are gorgeous. But there are so many different areas to discover. So it's very walkable. And if you don't want to walk or if you, or if you, or if you aren't able to, they do have, whoop, they just passed by me, the uh, like golf cart type vehicles right there. And you just ask and they can take you around. And of course that's free, but everything is just within a few minutes by foot or by the cart transportation. The food is very diverse here. Um, what else was I going to tell you about this uh, hygiene? Um, masks you need to wear a mask when you walk around in public um that's not just a thing for this hotel that's a thing that we should all be doing everywhere as long as the pandemic uh continues because uh, we need to protect ourselves we need to protect others and be respectful when we visit other countries if we choose to travel now um so there are a lot of things that we can do bring your hand sanitizer also when you check in they give you a hygiene kit which includes a mask not this one but they give you a mask and a couple packets of hand sanitizer as well um, but there are there's hand sanitizer everywhere around the property so that's good another view of some of the lovely the lovely um, grounds here